Hey guys, what's up? My name is Noob and welcome to another episode of Art of War Red Tides. And in this episode, we are going to be looking at the Gorilla. The Gorilla is a mechanical unit that is basically made to counter other mechanical units. So basically what it does is it fires rockets that deal... Whoa, okay, that was fast. Uh... Massive damage to mechanical singular mechanical units. There is nothing else uh, that it does really. It's um, It's a very you know It's a sister cinema. Yeah, exactly. It's a situational unit and I'm playing against a Yaguar. I will do the same playing against a... Uh, I, I'll play a 1v1 and then a 3v3. Uh, and... Uh, yeah. Let's see. Um, it's mainly for a, a counter for mechanical units. But the Alsteam Gorilla is not really... Special. They're all special in my eyes. Is it here. You ask me why do I have jump jet infantry and snipers? Because then I can counter both air and land units. Like now, I will actually rather build. Um, And they do also massive damage, by the way. So I have snipers uh, that can attack air units as well as ground units. And then I have the um, these troops to attack. Unsightly uh, ground units. Increases flight duration to 15 seconds. That's actually more than enough. It's also the nice thing about these uh, uh, jump jet infantry if they're gonna build like something like uh, the the uh, Iron Bird Riders or some stupid tactic uh, like that. Uh, they have uh, the ability to go in the air and uh, avoid being attacked, which is good. Legendary. 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 So I have plenty of money. So let's bring in the gorilla. So I want to upgrade the gorilla and uh, let's put them on full. Ah. Building Shuriken Pandas, that's gonna suck. Because Shuriken Pandas will counter my gorillas. Dominated. 
Revenge. Revenge. So you can give it 15 more health. So that's 230 now. Dominating. I actually want to have a sentinel. Yeah, I did. Look how fast they attack. They attack extremely fast, the gorillas. They attack every 0.68 seconds, firing two, two missiles at a time. Okay, so now I want to bring in some... Uh, I don't have butchers, so I took them out. Because um, the reason why I took out the butchers is because... Uh, I don't want to put too much mechanical in my build. Doing that will just invite pain in your life. Now I wanted to bring in some biological, so especially the heavy pavasiers that that uh, allows your uh, troops to uh, return uh, 10 10 damage uh, to to their respective attackers, and uh, yeah, that that actually helps a lot. Yo, what is this? It's mayhem! It's a bloody murder. See how fast they attack, look at that. They don't do much damage though. Oh, I can stop dropping bombs on them. I've reported many times that I really need air-to-air -air missiles! Get over here. So the mortars will just give me an up uh, uh, upgraded. Let's make their flight time longer. Yes, I have a very nice, robust, rounded feet here. Dominating. All aboard! Last stop, everything must go. God life. Legendary. The enemy base is just Ooh, ahead. Ooh, anti-air units. Legendary. Let's sell them. Let's bring up the anvil. Look at those attacks, like... <laughs> but the thing is, they have to get close to you, otherwise they don't... <laughs> Victory is at hand, Commander. Victory is at hand, Selling the mortars because they're bringing out um, 
uh, the uh, Bowcat. And I'm pretty sure I'm gonna start selling these. The uh, troopers as well. The final battle is about to start. Get ready for the last charge. Holy crap! They're actually doing really well. I need them. Perfect combination of ancient and modern technology. I need them. Come on. Yo, that. <laughs> nah, this. This is not good. Look at all of those units. Damn. I was not focused. Just that healing is just insane. Look how much healing they have gone on going. <laughs> I lost. How could I lose? Well, just a little bit unlucky. Well, that was a disappointing loss. Remember, I do this so that you don't have to. Okay. Let's try that again. Uh, coins can be earned through daily quests, gains from battle. You are tired, you gain coins from battle at 50% rate. Coins boost daily quests, uh, blah blah blah. Okay. Let's do that in 3v3. Now, I had to think about it. The gorilla is not uh, the best unit that came out of the three, I think the best would be the Mammoth. Uh, yeah. Mammoth is pretty good, I like him. Let's read up on him a bit more. The Mammoth Vanguard uh, ferociously charges forward toward enemy dealing 50 damage to up to 5 enemies in its path. After this charge ends, it inflicts 75 damage at enemies nearby. So you can upgrade it to be 125 and fully upgrade it attack damage for that short amount of time. Eh. Let's see, yeah, the, I can see that working in team battles, especially ranked. What is the commander, the leaderboards now, worldwide? Supreme Commander. Oh, I played against this guy the other day. I think we lost just, like, very close. Okay. Yeah, well, let's just try. It's very hard to play. Well, the Gorilla is a very specific unit, only attacks, only good against uh, mechanical units. Uh, I would play him against someone with the Butcher or something like that. Let's see what we can do. The battle is about to begin. Mm, who am I playing against? Atlak. I usually kept for myself. I usually kept for myself. In three versus three mode, all players take turns to deploy troops. Please don't miss out on your turn. Okay. Move to engage. Thank you for the advice. I will take it to my in consideration. Heavy flamethrower. Ah, uh, there's the Iron Bird Rider. It's our round, and our soldiers are ready and waiting. Our soldiers have arrived at the battlefield. I'm gonna rob both of them. Watch, 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 watch.
Now he changed. He sold his flamethrowers. To battle. Let's do that strat again. Oh, there we go. Revenge. Okay. Dominating. Soul Essence Mine upgrade completed. Okay. Maybe they just get hide from me. Uh, detector units, and then I will start bringing in the. Gorillas. It'd be nice if they can attack air units as well. Or just something, some active ability that makes them good. But for now they don't particularly do much. Nice! They're just Our has been so weak. Don't be discouraged. We are only retreating temporarily. Just too weak. Uh, I need the answer. I'm dominating. That's good. Yeah, I don't know. I'm gonna have to s mark the 
the gorilla as a as a <laughs> not the best unit in the world. Not the best unit in the world. Okay. So I've got some answers coming out at least. Archie, please. Yay! Oh. Use your active ability, dude. Nothing I can do there. Wow, that guy just blindly shot his data funds abilities. why I'm selling them is because they have two tech points that I need. Again, I'm only gonna have one? What is this madness? This is Sparta! Oh gosh, that was not good. Yay! <laughs> Most of my units are mechanical, so this does not affect them. Okay. Ah, now you're giving me the money. <laughs> da, 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 da. Yeah, gorillas. There's better units. Not really my cup of tea for a unit. But there you have it. At least all all of the units. And uh, let me play a bit and see which units are actually worth it. I th really think the mammoth is worth it. Uh, the chanter as well. Uh, I'm going to do some uh, training for them. And uh, I will really uh, rather put the chanter with the... Uh, with the scholar and then put a few of these uh, heavy blade slaves and then change it up to have vajras and stuff like that maybe the shield slave ah they don't have any h any shield see 
These things you need to know. You can do that. Not do do that. Great whale, good work. But anyway, that's it for this episode, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you learned something because uh, if you're planning to buy these units, go for the mammoth immediately. Don't go for the gorilla. The gorilla is like not that great. I mean, it it has low health. Um, just think of the butcher has 150 more health than him, which is almost double. So that makes a big, 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 big difference. But that's it for me, guys. Make your own decisions. So if you have any questions, please let me know. Please like, please subscribe. Let me know what you think. See you guys in the next one. Bye-bye, guys.